Hey, what's up you guys? It's me, and today I'm going to be going through my closet a little bit, and I'm going to show you the kinds of clothes that I wear when I'm not binding. So this is going to be a bit of a lookbook. This is lookbook one, which is my not binding go-tos, and then I'm going to have lookbook number two, which is going to be just fashion in general. So let's get started. That looks so bad, but like, fine. <laughs> Guys, I totally don't. It's too hot for this. Too hot for this. Okay, so my room's a mess now. There's clothes everywhere. But basically, what I do when I'm not binding is that I wear shirts that are typically a size up from what I usually wear when I'm not binding. Um, so I wear my larger shirts. I wear a lot of variations of jackets, like this one, are absolutely amazing for when it's warm and such. The I could find the sleeve, you know. It's a sleeveless hoodie. It's what it's advertised as. Sleeveless hoodie. It's the thing. It's the shit. Um, so yeah, that's basically what I wear when I'm not binding. And I typically, you don't notice at all. Like, you really can't tell in this shirt. A little bit from the side. But like, honestly, if you weren't really looking for it. And if you didn't know to look there for anything. You definitely wouldn't see it at all. So that is all of the variations of the things that I wear when I'm not binding. It's a bunch of different shirts like this one. All of them are in the wash right now because I haven't been binding a lot recently. So that's basically it's basically what I wear and um, yeah I'm gonna include some of the places that they're from in the down bar and uh, probably in the video too. I haven't decided yet. So that's basically what I got for you. So I shall see you in the next video which is even more fashion and I swear to god it looks nothing like this one and it looks so much better so you better watch it. Alright thanks bye.